Welcome to the world's first Farathon, a tough bus race in which the Volvo 7900 hybrid is pitched against a modern diesel bus to see if it can live up to its reputation regarding fuel consumption and exhaust emissions. Hybrid buses are by definition better than conventional diesel buses in these two areas. The question is, how much better? Hybrid versus diesel. And they're off. The hybrid is really quiet. Really great line through the curve there. Yeah, and that's where the hybrid technology is really at its best. How do you mean? Well, as soon as the brakes are applied, their retardation energy is converted into electricity that's used to recharge the battery. Seventh lap, time for a bus stop. Things are really moving here. Yes, that's right, because the hybrid has wider doors that make boarding and exiting faster and easier. The teams are hard at work. They're really in sync. They're checking oil, tire pressures, noise levels. It'll be exciting to see the final result. But hold on a minute. The hybrid team has carried sacks corresponding to seven more people. Volvo has succeeded in reducing the structural weight by more than half a ton, which means the hybrid can carry more passengers. And they're off again. This is a classic stop-start situation, and the hybrid has the upper hand here. The drivers are really giving it all they've got. No doubt about it, they're real professionals. It's absolutely vital to be focused, just like in inner city driving. They're speeding up even more, they're neck and neck. And it's the last lap, it's all or nothing now. This is nail-bitingly exciting. Things are hotting up as the finishing line approaches. The diesel bus driver is desperately trying to block his competitor on the final stretch. Oh, that's smart. And there they take the checkered flag. What a fight from start all the way to finish. Yes, there's no doubt the hybrid team won easily there. But by how much, I wonder, that's going to be interesting to see. 37% lower fuel consumption. Fantastic. And of course, that also means an equal reduction in carbon dioxide emissions. Wow, that's a grand total of 50% lower emissions if we include nitrogen oxides and particulates. And the noise level was an overall 23 decibels lower. What a winner. You just have to congratulate Volvo on yet another fantastic product. A state-of-the-art bus that's all set to take its customers even further.